Hey, good morning. I think it's Wednesday, halfway through the week. I'm Andy Ross. I'm one of the pastors at Northminster Presbyterian Church in Tucson, Arizona. And today uh, I wanted to highlight some of my office staff here. Uh, some of you have been asking me, hey, tell us about your fish. <laughs> These are red minor tetras. And you know, now they're shy. Whenever I feed them, they are front, center, right in the front of the tank. Hello, Andy, let's go with the omelets, the food. Um, but now that I've got a light on, oh, they are so in the back. They are busted. Anyway, uh, I've got two little tetra fish, Bob and uh, Ken, and they keep me company. I just... I think fish are cool because it's just the amazing artistry of God's creative hand in creatures, right? Okay. Salute to all you Aquarius out there. I I'm featuring my friends hiding in the back because today we have this classic scene. Jesus is walking along the Sea of Galilee. Our, uh, uh, it's from Matthew chapter 4, starting at verse 18. Jesus is walking along the Sea of Galilee. He sees a couple of brothers, um, Simon and Andrew. And he says, why don't you come with me? I'll teach you how to fish for people. Don't just catch perch and bass. Let's catch real people in the wonderful net of God's healing force, presence, spirit, right? So they follow, they drop their nets, they follow Jesus, and the gospel story goes on from there. Jesus and his 12 disciples, they go into the village immediately following this scene. They touch people, they care for people, People find healing relief from their sicknesses and illnesses. They are helped. That's the kind of work that Jesus does in and through us disciples and through the church. Helping, healing, speaking and showing the presence of Jesus and catching people in God's net of saving love. That's what our story is all about. Friends, I just want to encourage you, you're halfway through the week. How are you showing the love, the justice, the goodness of God in Christ in how you're living your life? And how are you speaking of God's love, of Jesus, to those around you? Sharing your faith, Jesus says, come follow me. I hope that can begin for you today. You and I, we need to think outside the tank. Lord bless you.